Hey friends, welcome back to Bed Fumes. I'm your host Sarthak, and you can also call me Uncle. We are on the to-do list our mini project, and this project idea is suggested by Mashad Zaid. And thank you, Mashad, for your idea. And I have implemented your idea. And if you have any idea, and if you want something from me, then please feel free to comment. So we are on the to-do list mini project, and we have successfully done many things. We have successfully created the database, the model, migration, create page, home page, resource controller, layout pages, everything. Now we have to save our data to the database. Okay, for that I will just go to add new and type here this is new item and click submit. Obviously nothing happened because in the store function we does not have anything. So where is the store function? Store function is in the to do controller, and here is the store function. By the way, we have seen here when we go with the post request on to do URI, we will go to the controller store function. Okay, here I will just return request and all so that I will check that everything is working fine or not, and just click submit, and you can see the CSRF token and the body is given here that means our form is work, working perfectly fine to save the data to database we have obviously made a model to do model so we will just use that model so i will type use app and model name is to do so here i will type to do is equal to new to do and after that i will just delete this and i will say to do dash body is equal to request body and after that to do and save function and after all these things I have to redirect so I will return redirect redirect where redirect to to do home page okay let's see the result and here I will say this is new item and I click submit and you can see we are on the to do home page that means our submitted function uh, was working fine for that just go to our database click refresh and you can see the item is okay now but the problem is our item is not seen here this is the hard coded one so let's just quickly do that thing so you can see this is the hard coded I will just delete this and you can see there is no item. So how will I get the data from the database for that go to the to do controller and the index for here I will say to do's is equal to to do colon colon all and I will pass this data to my view with the help of function called compact and here I will say in the home page just say for each and in here the array name is to do's and element will be only to do what I will I will echo here to do body and let's just see refresh and yep this is the new item and let's add another item this is another item item yep submit and you can see the items are here so we have successfully done the save to database okay now the validation but before validation I will just want the created at on here okay so for that I will go home page and here I will say span and inside that span I will just type to do created at and close this and let's see the result yep this time is here but I want to pulled on the right side so I will just type here class pull right okay this is here so we have successfully done this but I want not this time of creation I want to display the time how much time before it was created for that we have 
the carbon instance here and you can search for the carbon on the Google with carbon level and you will find the different kinds of function for that I will use the carbon function called diff diff for humans and let's see the result and when I refresh you can see this is three minutes ago created this is one minute ago created and when I can say this is third item and hit submit and this is one second ago created okay so we have done this part and now the trimmed data trimmed data is just like this when I type here with the space I will type this is new item and again sum of the space and enter and click submit you can see this is trimmed that means only this is here no space bar no enter but wait there's a problem I have two identical items in the list so how will I protect so for the protection we will hear the validations for validation I will just go to my controller and on the store function I will firstly say this validation and here obviously the request then comma then bracket close this and I will say the field name body is obviously required and also this should be unique unique for which table for to do's table okay that's good and when I copy this when I copy this add new say click here and click submit and validation does not exist what happened okay the problem is it, this is not validation this is validate okay now hit enter try again when I type here click submit and you can see it is on the same page and not submitted anything why because we have said unique and when I just submit a blank text box then also it will return to the same page nothing was submitted why because we have done required okay now the problem last is we does not have errors so we completed the validation this now time to display the errors so for displaying error I will just go to my create page and here I will say if count errors is greater than zero then for each for each errors all and here I will say error and just I will say error delete this and you can see the error here the body is required and when I will just copy this and paste it here submit this and yep the body has already been taken so we have successfully displayed the error if you want to format this thing something so you can say alert and again alert danger or you can say warning and wrap this inside the div and when I click submit you can see this is on a warning page I think danger will be good danger click submit and yes this body field is required so we can see that we have successfully completed our to-do list mini project and if you want to implement something new in this project please feel free to ask me I will obviously implement that thing and make a video only for you and if you have new ideas for creating a new video please suggest me I will make that video and obviously subscribe to my channel if you have not already subscribed 
प्लीज कमेंट योर प्रॉब्लम इन दिस वीडियो और इन द लास्ट वीडियो ऑफ द टू डू लिस्ट मिनी प्रोजेक्ट एंड इफ यू हैव प्रॉब्लम इन योर प्रोजेक्ट इन एनी वेयर प्लीज फील फ्री टू आस्क मी आई विल ऑब्वियसली हेल्प यू एंड प्लीज शेयर दिस वीडियोज टू योर डेवलपर फ्रेंड्स सो दैट एवरी वन गेट द नॉलेज ऑफ द बेस्ट थिंग दैट मीन्स द लेरेवल सो वी विल मीट इन द नेक्स्ट एपिसोड with more cool steps of the level so please stay tuned and like my videos